Welcome to Mass Mathmax in Minutes. Today's topic is about the exterior angles of irregular polygons. And we'll cover a couple examples on how to calculate angles of irregular polygons. And we will conclude the topic with a summary. And finally, be kind and subscribe for more videos. So, what are exterior angles of irregular polygons? The sum of the exterior angles of a polygon with any number of sides is always 360 degrees. And this is true for regular or irregular polygons. Irregular polygons have sides of not equal length. Consider the first example. We have a polygon with six sides and these sides are not equal in length. And it has six exterior angles. The second example is where we have a polygon with seven sides, and it has seven exterior angles. And finally, we have a polygon with eight sides and eight exterior angles. So all of these polygons are irregular polygons because the sides are not equal in length. In the first example, we're asked to calculate the angle X, and we're given a polygon with seven sides. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And we're asked to calculate that angle x. So, the sum of the exterior angles is always 360 degrees, regardless of how many sides the polygon has. And so we can calculate x as equals to 360 degrees, which is the total angle, minus 85, which is that angle, minus 30 degrees, which is that angle, and so on. Minus 60, minus 62, minus 59, and minus 15. And that gives us x is equals to 49. In the second example, we're asked to calculate the sum of the exterior angles of an irregular polygon with 51 sides. So the sum of the exterior angles is always 360 degrees, regardless of how many sides the polygon has and it holds for both regular and irregular polygons. In the third example, we're asked to consider an irregular polygon with eight sides, and we're given the sum of the first seven exterior angles is 330 degrees, and we're asked to calculate the size of the remaining exterior angle. So we know the sum of the exterior angles is always 360 degrees, regardless of the number of sides. And so the sum of the remaining exterior angle is 360 degrees, which is the total, minus 330 degrees, which is given from the question. And that gives us 30 degrees as the remaining exterior angle. In the fourth example, we're asked to consider an irregular polygon with 10 sides, and we're given that the sum of the exterior angles is 360 degrees, and we're asked to calculate the size of each exterior angle. Because we're given an irregular polygon, we're unable to divide 360 degrees by 10, because this polygon has sides of not equal length, and so the exterior angles will not be identical. And therefore, we are unable to find the size of each exterior angle. To summarize, the sum of the exterior angles of a polygon with any number of sides is always 360 degrees. And this is true for regular or irregular polygons. Irregular polygons have sides of not equal length. Consider the first example with six sides and six exterior angles. And the second example is where we have seven sides with seven exterior angles. And finally, we have eight sides with eight exterior angles. And all of these polygons are irregular polygons. Thank you very much for watching. This is Master Mathematics in Minutes.